Hi and welcome to my channel. It's me, Tina. I am here with a... My watch is talking to me here. I'm here with a Dollarama haul. Please excuse the hair and the face. Um, I'm not putting on makeup because... Uh, here's the story. I was uh, making uh, vegetable soup and um, I was trying to get the I had soup bones and I was just trying to get the 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 meat off the bones just to to leave it in the soup so somehow I went like this and a piece of carrot hit me right here and it act uh, I guess it was so hot it like burnt in there I had to like take it off I got splattered here and here and here so yeah I had yeah, I had to deal with that. I've been dealing with that for a few, uh, I would say close to two weeks now, but it's just about better. It's getting to the point where, you know, it's not, it doesn't hurt when I touch it. But anyway, Dollarama haul. Um, it's going to be random. It's going to be food. It's going to be, yeah, random. So, uh staple in our house is the um, multi-grain Tostitos chips and we love those I especially love them and I got two of those bags and I also got the salsa but I don't know where that is and then I got this sharpener um, I don't know where the paper for it is but it's this sharpener anyway. It's the uh, one with the crank. And um, then it has this little this little thing. You, you, um, you pull it down and it suctions to your um, counter or your table. And it really works really, really well. I had the other one, um, the battery one. But I, it's like every time I wanted to use it, battery was dead. And this one was $4. The chips, I think, were $3 each. And let me see what else I got here. I got some regular Lay's chips. And I think they're $2 a bag there, if I'm not mistaken. And let me just get these out of here. How is everybody? I hope you're all doing good. We are doing good. I'm still trying to stay home for the most part. But um, I go out a little bit more. But not much. Um, I am trying to be really, really good. So, yes. I'm trying to find that salsa, but I can't. Did I not buy it? What? Okay. All right, then another thing that we really love, especially Billy and I, um, we love these uh, chocolate uh, rice cakes. Rice cakes with milk chocolate, and they are so good. So I got three or four of them, and they are only $1.25, so that's a really good price. And then I got a package of these, and I think these are $2. I don't know, I haven't been in Dollarama so long, I forget the prices. And, um, salt and vinegar chips. Oh, I've been craving these like crazy. Mm, got an itchy nose. So, I think they're a dollar. Fifty or a dollar twenty-five a box, cheap anyway. It yeah, it's cheap to be fat. And uh, then I got my husband for Father's Day. I got him these socks, and it says, "If you can read this, bring me the remote control," because he's one of those guys he likes to the remote control in his hand at all times so these were they look like nice socks 250 so they're cool and then I got a bunch of um, 
these little wooden boxes and I'm going to be doing a craft with them. They were $1.25 and uh, yeah, I think this will be really cool. I can't wait to do that. Um, not sure if I'm going to share it. Um, let me know if you want to see how I do it. Um, it has been done on YouTube before. Um, I saw somebody else doing it. So, okay, that's the blocks. So let me know if you want me to show you how I do mine. Um, totally up to you if you want to see it. And then I saw these. It says printed PVC sheet. And I wasn't sure what it was. Um, so I got two of them. I have one open here. But you know what the vinyl uh, tablecloths kind of feel like? That's what this feels like to me. Um, it's got like a material back and then it has like kind of like a rubber front. And they're not very big. I would say if you like this kind of stuff for crafting, see if there's a tablecloth that you like. Um, I mean, I liked these pineapples on here, but um, I figured for a journal cover or something it would work. But I was thinking it would be more material fabric and it's more plastic. Um, then I found these little pieces. There is uh, three of them in here and it's puzzle pieces. And I've been making, um, I'll show you what I've been doing. I've been making these, uh, mm, let's see, these puzzle charms. This one's not quite done, but um, these are, these are kind of big. These are a little bit smaller, so I figured I would give those a try and see how they work out. Um, this one's with a ribbon. Oops. With a ribbon. I think they're really cute. And these were actual puzzle pieces. But, um, yeah, you can decorate them really nice and uh, make charms out of them. Um, do I have any finished ones? No, I just have a bunch that I'm working on. So you can see I got <laughs> a ton here. And I'll add that to there. And I wanted to add these charms to the bottom of them. So I think that'll be cool. And then I found some more uh, washi tape. Um, it is the Create 365. Um, I think this is the kind that they have at Michael's. There is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rolls, is it, in here? And um, I liked it because it had more of the vintage colors um, in it. And I got this one too, and I really liked this one. This one I really like when I do my um, the Gorgeous Girls. Um, it kind of matches them, so I really like that. I had forgotten I had gotten, gotten those. And uh, then um, I got two of these containers it's like a little bucket um they were four dollars and these were i don't know 250 or 350 i forget how much they were and these ones were i believe a dollar 25 yeah these were four dollars and i got two of them so they're like a bucket. Um, they have a little handle here. Um, you can take off. It's not this lid is not on here very securely, which kind of I'm like, hmm. And then it has the little sections here, and then you can take that out, and then you can add things in there. And then it also has um, 
one, two, three, four, five little containers like this that hang on to the side. And uh, they open. Oh my gosh, I can't even open them. They open like. Oh, I was opening them wrong. They open like this. Like that. And then it has uh, little sections in here. But you cannot. I believe you cannot take these little sections out. So they're really tiny sections. But if you have like little uh, pins and paper clips and buttons and stuff, um, like I think it's a, what they suggest here is um, like a sewing. Well, it says storage box craft organizer. organizer. But like you could put a nice um, roll of thread in here and your needles and things. And then in the next one, you can do buttons and, uh, yeah. So, and this stack, you can stack them like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. And they were $4 each, like I said. And I think that is it. So if you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Um, I am looking for the 1,200 subscribers, then I will do a huge giveaway, and I am just getting my stuff together for that, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, yeah, I hope you are enjoying my crafting videos. I don't have too many shopping videos, um, but that was my goal at the beginning of the year anyway, was to slow down on the shopping and use my stuff. And I have been doing a lot of crafting and, um, yeah, that's what I've been doing. Um, so I will get to show, uh, you soon what I've been doing. So talk to you later. God bless you, everyone. We'll see you soon. Bye.